Hello friends, welcome to my channel Digital Chemistry. Today's topic is about an amazing state of matter that is plasma. So in this lesson we will discuss about plasma that what is plasma, how plasma is formed, what are the characteristics of the plasma, types of the plasma with examples from our daily life and also its applications. So let's start. Do you know that what is plasma? Plasma is derived from Greek word means moldable substance or jelly. It is the fourth and the ionized state of the matter which consists of free moving neutral particles, positively charged nuclei and the negatively charged electrons. Plasma is neutral as a whole due to the equal number of the positive ions and the negative electrons. About 99% of the universe is in plasma state. Unlike the other three states of matter, solid, liquid and gas, plasma do not exist freely on the earth's surface under normal conditions and must be artificially generated from neutral gases. So simply we can say that it is the state of matter that consists of ionized gases. So the question is how plasma is formed? To understand the formation of plasma, let's consider here a neutral gas atom. So when a neutral gas is heated to a very high temperature, what happened that the electrons get excited and are knocked out from an atom or a molecule. So as a result, what happened as you can see here in a diagram that the positively charged nuclei and the negatively charged electrons are formed. And so they are ionized and constitute the plasma. Remember that the number of the cations and the free moving electrons are equal, therefore plasma is neutral as a whole. So here we conclude that the plasma is the fourth state of matter having a significant number of the electrically charged particles. Although plasma is electrically neutral, but the plasma is having a significant and remarkable applications because of its sensitivity to the electrical and the magnetic field. Do you know that about 99% of the universe is in state of plasma? Yes, the plasma is formed in the atmosphere of the sun, stars and the upper region of the atmosphere. It means that the sun, stars as well as the space contain the plasma. Also during the lightning plasma is produced. Do you know that the luminous clouds also contain plasma? Plasma is also used in the electrical arc used by the welders. And the flame also contain plasma. Let's talk about the applications of the plasma. Do you know that in fluorescent lamps plasma are used? The passage of electricity through the gas in the tube causes the ionization of the gas and hence plasma is produced which glows inside the tube of the lamp. In neon signs plasma are also used. Here the passage of electricity through the gas in the tube produces the plasma due to the ionization of the gas which glows inside the tube. Plasma is also used for the cleaning and the sterilization of the food material and for the destruction of the bacteria, virus and fungi. For the removal and the destruction of the harmful or the dangerous chemicals and the sterilization of the operation theaters, plasma are used. Plasma are also used for the operating and the working of the electronic equipments like the display screens of the televisions and computer monitors. For increasing the mechanical strength of some polymeric substance and also in controlling the fusion reactions, plasma are also used. Let's talk about the characteristics of the plasma. As you know that the plasma consists of ionized gases, therefore the plasma conduct heat and electricity due to many unique properties that are different from the solid, liquid and gas. Types of plasma There are two types of plasma. First is the natural plasma and the second is the artificial plasma. 
The natural plasma exists only at a very high temperature and the minimum temperature for the natural plasma is about 20,000 degrees Celsius. Sun, stars, space, lightning and the luminous clouds etc. are the examples of the natural plasma. Whereas the artificial plasma can be created by the electrical charges on a gas. Examples of the artificial plasma are fluorescent lamps, neon signs, LED screens, etc. Don't forget to like this video and share with all your friends and don't forget to subscribe my channel Digital Chemistry. Thank you for watching.